Uh, Deputy Speaker, there are very few people in Braddon and across Australia who have not been impacted in some way by drug and alcohol abuse or mental illness of sorts, whether it be a family member or friend who has been diagnosed with depression or someone in the community who has fallen victim to a drug or alcohol addiction. It is unfortunate reality that a significant number of people have either their own experience to tell or the experience of someone they know that's been impacted by the effects of substance abuse or mental illness. In Braddon, uh, Deputy Speaker, the Somerset Football Club is holding an event to start the conversation about drugs, alcohol and depression. This event, called Shirt Front the Big Three, tackles drugs, alcohol and depression through sport. The community forum targets sports clubs and management of sports associations. A number of community and sporting leaders will be speaking at the forum with a focus on the effects and ramifications of drugs, alcohol and depression on our society, but specifically towards sporting clubs. This event is about getting people with first-hand experience in dealing with substance abuse and mental illness to work with the community to have a local community-based approach to tackling these issues that confront the people of Australia on a daily basis. Shirt Front, the big three, will have a representative from AFL Tasmania, Tasmania Police, experts on mental health and substance abuse, sporting representatives, as well as recovering addicts and sufferers of depression. Deputy Speaker, I'll be attending this event and ask any of those in the Somerset region to come along to work with us on tackling drugs, alcohol and depression in our region. The clubs and administrators session is on the 23rd of March and the session for the community of Somerset and its surrounds is on the 24th of March. Both of these sessions are to be held at Langley Park at 6pm, <coughs> the home of the Somerset Football Club. Deputy Speaker, when I'm out in the community, I hear about the scourge of ice and other drugs on a daily basis, on their effects on our communities and the impacts they have on mental health and uh, all those people that are our loved ones around us. It is no secret, Deputy Speaker, that these are enormous problems that face each and every community in Australia. And I do today take the opportunity to congratulate the Somerset Football Club and especially Rod Groom on the initiative they've shown in putting together the Shirt Front the Big Three event. Events like these are the way forward in formulating a community-based approach. It's not just uh, those individuals and families who are experiencing the problems firsthand who need to come up with the strategies to combat the challenges. It's all of us, all of us that live on the northwest coast who must together take control of our place and take control of our future and formulate a community-based solution to the problems that arise from substance abuse and mental illness. Thank you.